Hey, you're going to go for a few drinks? What now? Come on, the night's young. Let's paint the town red. Eventually. Can't stand the doll forever. Can't sponge up your parents week in, week out. Alright, alright. I need to rub it in. But, you know, it's a real bummer. I just don't want to be stuck in a dead end job. You need the money, right? Counts for need too. Anyway, change the subject. Are you seeing anyone? It's a simple enough question. Are you seeing anyone? Yes or no? Okay, if you must know. No, I'm not. Are you? No, I'm not seeing anyone. Not on Michael Blazers. Bumbling an idiot come to mind. That's not true. You were always popular with the ladies at school. Yeah, but as popular as a song been long, September the 12th. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Go on, my son, make your move. Life's too short. But I can't. I can't tell how I really feel. Oh, what the hell? Billy! Oh, don't! don't. Oh, 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 sorry, I, I thought... Isn't it obvious that I'm not interested in you anymore? Uh, totally, to totally obvious. Oh, I didn't mean it like that. It's not that I don't like you, I do. But only as friends. Friends? That's cool. I've moved on with my life. And you uh, need I'm, to... I'm living in the past, I know. Oh, daft. We can still be friends, in a platonic relationship. Platonic? I can do platonic. <laughs> Look, you're a sweet guy it's and you'll sweet. and you'll find someone before too long. I'm really screwed up, didn't I? Look, do you want to come in? I'll have chat about it. Okay. Have a seat. Do you want a coffee? I'm not a minimalist. I don't have trunks with more furniture than you. Milk and two sugars, yeah? Uh, yeah, please. Back in Hello there. I'm Felix. Oh, uh, hi. I'm Billy. Billy? You're Susan's ex flame, aren't you? Oh, I've heard so much about you. Mm. Uh, so, what do you do for laughing, Billy? Uh, not a lot. Oh, that is fantastic. Susie's such a dirty little devil, isn't she? Dirty little whore. <laughs> I'm sure you know that. Darling, hello. Are you okay? Oh, hey, I'll just turn on telling his handsome SOB what a great fuck buddy you are. Shut up, you idiot. You know you love it, come ah! on, eh? <laughs> I think we're gonna go. Oh, I think your friend's leaving. Billy, where are you going? Billy? Billy, where are you going? Billy! What about Felix? Can you tell me a bit about Felix? Ah, oh, Felix is... Pratt. But he's a really, really good fun Pratt. More of a Pratt than Billy? Um, 
them. What's with the cardboard box, Billy? What cardboard box? The, the cardboard box on your head. What cardboard box? Can you, can you take it off, please? No. Look, j just for the sake of the interview, can you take off the cardboard box? No, leave me alone. Why? B because I don't want to. I look like an idiot. You, you already look like an idiot, you idiot. You got a cardboard box on your head? Billy, I think, will probably grow up to be a perfectly well-rounded individual. How confident are you about that? Not entirely. <laughs> no! Do it! Take it off! Take it off! No! Take it off! No! Um, I don't know, I think once he decides, once he sets his mind on something that is an attainable goal, I think he'll probably make it because he's a bright, bright guy. The place you didn't chase couple. It's very nice when they are together. They make a beautiful, beautiful couple. Ah. I would have liked Susan as a daughter. It's a tight long streak of wind. She's quite a shape. In the end, the age difference was a big problem. I see Billy more as a little brother than an old flame. I'm under no illusions that Susan's desperate to get back with me. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? Stop, stop laughing! Stop it! Stop it! Stop laughing! And you! Stop it! You're the worst! Stop it! Stop laughing at me! Go away! I do really deeply care about him, but we're very, very different people. How do you think he feels about you? Well, I think probably he feels a bit more than that, but I don't know whether that's just because he's quite lonely at the moment. What about his parents? What are they like? They're pretty mad. What about Billy's love life? Love life? <laughs> Billy! <laughs> love life! <laughs> <laughs> She's beautiful. And intelligent looking too. Go on, you idiot. See a big chance. Okay. Now play it cool. Don't come across as a jerk. Billy Heinle. Heinleberger. Then. My parents are part German, part Brummie. Wow. And it says here you've been unemployed for 18 months, is that right? Yeah. And how's the job hunting going? It's going great. And it says here you're a writer? Amongst other things, yeah. I'm a writer, artist, actor, musician, comedian, couch potato. Wow. Fascinating. Work that charm, cowboy. You've got her interested. Now, try and act natural. Man, she's hot. Emma. Her name's Emma. Emma's a cool name. And would you be willing to take your career in a new direction? Did she just say new direction or nude erection? Would you be willing to talk to one of our career advisors? They're very good. What they'll do... She's they'll got to be a radio advisor. She must be. Book you an appointment. Go on. Have a Ask her if she likes Radiohead. Shall I set you up with an appointment? Do you like Radiohead? 